Uh, this is another recording. Well, another recording of the EVA. This is uh, something we're going to play once and once and again in the future because this is something unprecedented. The first EVA by Chinese. It's the culmination of tens of years of efforts and also laying a foundation for may maybe decades of more space explorations in the future. I have to remind you, this is a recording of the EVA done by a Chinese astronaut about 30 minutes ago. At that time, Jajigan retrieved materials that are attached to the spacecraft. And he's handing back the material to Liu Boming. Jai Zhigang handing back the material to Liu Boming. This means that actually this is an EVA performed by two astronauts. The first two-man EVA in history was uh, performed on the Soyuz 4 and Soyuz 5 mission mm -hmm. by Evgeny Krunov and Alexei Yelisayev mm -hmm. back in 1969. And since that time, yeah. there have been many, many... Five years after their first EVA. Yes. There have been many, many two-person spacewalks. Mm -hmm. I think largely for safety reasons, that it's... Uh, it, it's in case something happened, you have yes. another astronaut helping you. Yes. And especially if they're doing complex mechanical things that might result in damage to the spacesuit. It's very wise to have another person present. Mm -hmm. What kind of help can the other astronaut provide if something happened to the other one? Temporarily, pull him back? temporarily plugging the hole and moving that person back into the airlock. Mm -hmm. Yes, You actually can uh, close a, an airlock and repressurize on an emergency basis quite quickly if you have to. I see. Uh, actually, uh, I think uh, once uh, during the International Space Station mission, they have two astronauts, two of them, just uh, performing EVA simultaneously and leaving nobody staying in the International Space Station. <laughs> That's uh, quite uh, something, <laughs> because you're actually the International Space Station is just empty without human being taking care. That reflects a high level of confidence in the automatic systems. They have to put the station into automatic uh, mode they, they, and, and assume, leave it. You have to assume that the computer aboard has not gone crazy and will <laughs> lock you out. Yeah, exactly. You have to have trust in those machines. At the 